Hey guys, Arby here. Today I'm doing the Eureka Math Grade 3 Module 2 Lesson 7 homework. So let's get started. Number one, match each object with its appropriate weight. All right, so we have 100 grams, 10 grams, 1 gram, and 1 kilogram. So let's start with 1 gram. I think that would be the paper clip because that's the lightest out of these. And then the coins would probably be 10 grams. That's about right. Let's see the water. On an apple, water is typically typically heavier, so I'd say that's one kilogram. And the apple will probably be 100 grams, so yeah. Number two, Alyssa, Al Alicia, Alicia, um, and Jeremy weigh a cell phone on a digital scale. They write down 113, but forget to record the unit. What unit of measurement is correct, grams or kilograms? How do you know? So a cell phone um, would most likely be grams because me, myself, I am not even 113 and the cell phone is definitely not heavier than me. And 113 kilogram would be like very, very heavy. So a cell phone would definitely be right. And it's also like kind of about the same weight as like maybe an apple, but a bit heavier. You know, so I think it would be 113 grams. Gram. Because 113 kilograms is heavier than me and is like, I don't know like 200 pounds or something so like, it's just like really heavy so like that would not make sense so yeah all right next page we're reading scales here guys so read and write the weights below write the word kilogram or gram with the measurement so when we're doing units it's always a good habit to write the unit measurement right after it whether it's like meters centimeters grams kilograms it's like a good habit to do so here i have kilograms um, so I think we're going by tens, as you can see, so 10, 20, and 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. So this one is 25 kilograms, because you can kind of see it's in the middle, 20 and 30. And soil, we're in kilograms too. So 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. This is 9 kilograms. And the scissor, well, this is 500, like up here, once you go up here, and this is 250. So I think we're counting by 50, 100, 150, 200, 250. So this is going by 50. And so this one is pointing at around 250 minus 50 is 200. So I think this is 200 grams. And next, the banana. You can see, okay, 360, 365, 366, 367. This would be 367 grams. Say, and the single banana, about 100, 105. I say that's 105 grams. Sorry. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video helps. And please don't forget to like and subscribe because it really helps on my channel. See you guys next time. Bye.